Hey guys, I'm getting a little late start. It's about 11 o'clock, a little late start on the vlog. I've just been busy like exporting. I want to have space for today. But now we are busy making some Valentines. I made Julia one, and then we're making her Nana some. And we made the dad. And we're making one for daddy. Making Valentines, aren't we? All right, who am I gonna make a Valentine for now? Who needs one now? Yeah, so we have Daddy, we have Nana, we have you. Who else do we need to make a Valentine for? Oh, thank you. I am, of course, basically purple. putting it all together because she's she's young. But she, I have her point to where she wants the hearts, and I have her choose the colors and what she wants on it, and basically what she wants to say. So yeah, she's making the Valentines. I'm just helping. Good afternoon, guys. We're all kind of being lazy right now. I uploaded my vlog from yesterday. Um, I do have a lot of laundry I need to do. Um, I do have things I need to do. I'm just too lazy to do it. Um, I don't know why. I, I, for some, I got good sleep, but for some reason I'm really tired today. I don't know why. The girls are watching Sheriff Cowley's Wild West. All right, hey guys. It is four o'clock right now. We are heading across the street to the gas station because I was just looking for my phone and I'm vlogging right now. Um, because I need to get a beverage and um, I'm gonna get her a lollipop because she's been a very good girl. So, going across the street, I'm also gonna check the mail. The main reason, to be totally honest, the main reason I'm leaving, I technically don't need to leave the house for anything, but the main reason I'm leaving the house is because sometimes when I'm feeling a little bit lazy or tired, and I shouldn't be tired, I just have to get up, leave the house, get a little bit of vitamin D, just because stepping out of the house helps me wake up. So that is why I left the house, to be totally honest. If I felt totally awake and I was at home, I wouldn't be leaving right now. But I am. Um, I wonder if that mail has come yet. Let's see. Um, It's not looking like the mail has come yet. All right. I'm in my workout clothing, but I'm also wearing this really cute bummer jacket. Totally a mix of, you know, clothing, but whatever. I need a new jacket. Oh, that's why I'm cold. The AC is on. What is going on here? So today's not terrible. So it's one of those days where I'm not feeling like super crappy, but just nothing is happening. Like it's just, I don't know. It's one of those days where just it's like my Sunday, you know, when you just want to sit on your ass and you want to, like, watch TV and then, you know, veg. It's one of those days. Wait, it is Sunday. What am I talking about? That's why I feel like this. It's Sunday. And so normally Sundays are my rest day. That's why I'm feeling, that's, like, I'm, why I'm kind of struggling. But I'm not, today's not my rest day because I took a rest day on Friday. And so I can't really afford to take a rest day today because I need to do my chest and back and shoulders and some cardio. I haven't done cardio in a week. <gasps> I'm so fat. Um, not literally, you know what I'm saying. Um, that's why I'm feeling so poopy today, or just like lazy, because I'm I'm used to having a rest day on some days, but um, I took mine on Friday, so I gotta get back in the room. And I need to be working out consistently, because we leave for Disney on Thursday, so I literally only have today, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday to pack, get a bunch of working out in, a bunch of filming done, so I cannot afford to be feeling like this right now. Um, all right, go car. Lori's on. All right. Yeah, so I have to go get this drink anyway so I can just, you know, get going. Anyway. Huh? Oh, it looks like they're filling up the, uh, the tanks with fuel. Yeah. I think it's time to get gas right now. It is gonna smell like some severe gasoline. It always smells just straight up like gasoline when the tanks have to get filled up. Am I allowed to drive on the right side of this thing? I don't know, but I'm going to. Anyway. Oh, those buffalo cheddar Cheetos. I love those. They are the bomb. We will, ah, hello, parking spot. I will park here, thank you. Bye -bye, 
Yep, we're getting you a lollipop. We were in there super quick. Good, now we are on our way back and I'm feeling good right now. They had like the greatest Cheetos ever. So, I had to get the Cheetos. Um, so I don't eat regular Cheetos. I eat um, these buffalo cheese. These buffalo, yeah, buffalo blue cheese. So I hate blue cheese and I hate buffalo sauce. But these buffalo blue cheese Cheetos, though, these are the bomb. Oh my gosh, I've been craving these. They're so good. Dude, don't drive down the middle of the road. Drive on the right side of the road. Gosh, dang, just because you're in a parking lot does not mean, or like, oh, whatever you want to call this, does not mean you can just drive wherever and you are still supposed to drive somewhat on, like, the right side of the road because, you know, there's other cars. So, I have to eat these right now. They're so good. Mmm! So good! What just hit me? Oh, my God. My garage door opener just tried to kill me. All right, so let me show you. They are the HERS, H-E-R-R-S, Buffalo Blue Cheese Flavored Cheese Curls. And they are the bomb.com. I'm serious. Don't be afraid to try them because I do not like buffalo sauce. I don't like blue cheese, but they are so good. So even if it's something that like you don't think you would like, like so these, like when my husband brought them home, I was like, ew, no. And he said, just close your eyes and try one. It was so good. So good. I can't put them down. Just, I still don't like buffalo blue cheese, but that is the bomb. So go try it. Um, it's hers buffalo chicken. No, it's hers buffalo blue cheese flavored cheese curls. Go try them out. I'm gonna have such a late night tonight because I have to go work out, but I can't work out until my husband gets home. And then I have to film a video after getting showered up. So I have a long night ahead of me. I don't know. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. You guys, share. Hey, use the lollipops, use the block, leave her alone. Back off. There's more blocks. Go grab them. Go go play with those. Back off of Marissa right now. No! Go hey, do you need to go on timeout? And back off of Rissa right now. Okay? I bought you a lollipop. Be good. No! Then give me the lollipop. No! Alright, then, then back off and be good. Thank you. Anyways, see so you guys are gonna see the bright side of parenting. So I think the best way to organize my time would be I can't was I wait, was I snapping? Yeah, no. Was I vlogging or snap? I can't remember who I'm talking to at this point. Anyways. Okay, so two things, two big things have to have. Oh, two big things have to. Gosh darn it! Two big things have to happen tonight. I have to film, and I have to do like a two-hour gym workout, and so that's a total of like three and a half hours of stuff. And my husband gets home at like seven, so I think the best use of my time would be to film first and then work out because I know for a fact after I work out once I shower I'm not gonna want to do anything so I think I should film first oh gosh oh gosh oh gosh no you know what I'm gonna be smart work has to come first I'm going to film and edit tonight because I have to have this makeup to show up for tomorrow and since my husband has tomorrow off I'm going to do a long gym workout tomorrow. That's what I'm doing because I have to film. Like, 100% have to. I've been working my booty off. If I have to skip a day of working out to get work done, that's what has to happen. So that is what's happening. So I'm going to go change. Did I shower today? No, wait. I showered, like, at 12 o'clock last night. So I'm good. Um, I know it sounds gross, but when you're a parent, you understand. I literally can't shower right now anyway because I have my kids here. And my husband's not here. So, hey, did you poop? Your butt's sagging. Rissa, come here, sweetie. Did you poop? Sorry, you guys. Oh, yeah, you did. I gotta change your poop diaper. Wow, that was powerful. Anyway, okay, all done.
Ugh, time to get some mommy cleaning done. That's gonna end up being totally pointless in about a half hour. Um, like, I swear I'm a clean person, you guys. Like, I know it always looks super, like, janky in the background, but, like, you guys don't understand. Like, if you have toddlers, you understand, but y'all just, it, it's, it, it is a commitment. It is more than a full-time job to keep your house somewhat picked up when you have two kids, like, in prime toddler age. So, um, yeah, I really struggle, so I gotta pick up all the toys again. Do more dishes, do more laundry, and yada, 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 yada. How perfect was my decision to film tonight? My husband just called me saying that he's like, I know that you always have a good gym workout plan, but I'm going to be home really late tonight or later than normal tonight. So um, I don't know if you still want to work out. And I was like, you know what? It's actually great that I just made the plan to film instead because now it's okay if he's late. <laughs> Boom. We're mentally working together. That's right. Oh. Okay. So, oh, oh, so I'm like looking at... Wait, yeah, okay. So, um, I talk about this mask in my favorites. This Daddy. is the Derma E Purifying Two in One Charcoal Mask, and I'm gonna film a video, no. but I want my skin to be like super clear for when I do. So I figured since I talked about this mask, my favorites, I, no, I would just like I talk about like how intense this is an intense mask. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this just so I can show you. No. I'm gonna be using the Morphe MB or so the MB9. This is just a flat foundation brush um, and I always apply a mask with foundation brushes you know like the flat ones just because I get the most even coverage and I don't get my hands messy so I'm gonna go ahead and apply this um, and then yeah you guys can just watch how it happens and then while it's drying I'm gonna tweeze my eyebrows because um, they're looking a little cray Seriously, you guys, if you have not applied your mask with a brush like this, you are missing out. My hair. I noticed before I did this, I would waste so much product. I'm gonna be washing so much off my hands, but look, see, like, there's all this extra. I could just keep redistributing it. You're ew. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Fully applied, I gotta take it off my lips because I don't want to like dry out my lips or anything like that. So I gotta get a baby wipe. And I don't know if you can see it, but it has so many just like exfoliating beads um, that you rub in after this thing's totally dry. Um, hang on. What are you doing? I'm getting off my lips, sweetie. Okay, so you wait for it to dry. It doesn't take long to dry. And once it's dry, then you rub in the beads. So while I'm waiting for this to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and what are you, what are you holding this, sweetie? I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to tweeze my eyebrows. All right, so it's been about five minutes. It's basically all dried. This is what it looks like. I know it looks super blue right now, but it's like a slate gray. But I'm gonna start, when it's dry, I'm gonna start massaging the beads in. And then when you are to dampen your hands a little bit, and then you're gonna go in again. And look, it's gonna like reactivate it. And this one gets like really intense. And then once you've like done the majority of it and then you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna rinse your face like normal but when you're rinsing it you're gonna massage it but you of course want to avoid getting in your eyes like normal so i'm gonna go ahead i've got a lot of massage i'm gonna go ahead and rinse my face and then i will show you <laughs> 
All right, so I just took the mask off, and my face is so incredibly red. But the redness goes away, but oh my gosh, if you guys could just feel my skin right now, I literally feel like, like, it's so smooth, and my nose, like, it's so clear now. Like, there isn't, like, a single thing in my pore, and my face is so smooth. Oh my god, I love this mask, you guys. I just want to keep touching my face, but I'm immediately going to go moisturize it, just so that... You know, it doesn't dry out. It is baby soft right now, you guys. Like, you know, it is softer than baby skin. So, I'm gonna go moisturize and then do some dishes. All right, my eyebrows look so much better. They look so janky before. I mean, still, they always look better when I get them waxed, but it's better than nothing. Um, so I can at least do a video and feel like, not feel like I'm looking really, really weird. Gosh, my face is so red right now, but I just love how it feels. I love that mask. I highly recommend it. Once again, the Derma E Purifying 2-in-1 Charcoal Mask Activated Charcoal. Right there. So you should go check it out. I'll put a link to it on Amazon so you can go check it out. All right, you guys. I just finished filming two videos. I am in my PJs. I have to edit the makeup tutorial now because it has to go up tomorrow. But I just thought I would end this vlog for you guys. Um, I had a really good day. And I hope you liked coming along with me during my day. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my vlog channel. Check out my beauty channel down below. And I will see you guys tomorrow.